country became independent. But in real sense, something was missing. So what was missing? Suppose we have shifted in a new house, a new home, and the rules and regulations were made by the old owner. So it is not possible to survive there. So in the leadership of Dr. Baba Sahai Ambedkar, on 26 January 1950, our constitution came into the force. Our country became a democratic country. Democracy means government by the people, for the people, and of the people. Early in the morning, we have unfurled the national flag. I would like to describe the interesting facts about our national flags. The orange and the green color shows the unity of Hindu and Muslims. The white color shows the other castes and performs for peace. And the Ashok wheel is taken from the Ashok Chak. Every citizen got the right of independence. Fundamental rights. Fundamental right means everybody is free to speak. Everybody is free to say. Everybody is free to live. Everybody is free to live in their lifestyles. Everybody is free to guard their religions. It means the rules and regulations are same. Either he or she, CM, PM or any other ordinary persons. If anybody crimes, anybody does good job, then he or she is rewarded or punished. It doesn't matter he or who he or she. That is the meaning of fundamental rights. In real sense, we are not independent. Because our freedom fighters don't want to see us like in this way as we are now. Till now, we are quarreling, we are fighting. So many problems are there in India. Corruptions, violence, unemployment, illiteracy. So who is responsible for this? After all, we are responsible and we have to correct this. If anything goes wrong near about you, so who will correct it? It's not the duty of a person or a particular person who is going to correct it. We have to correct it. We have to solve it. We have to find the way how it can be corrected. So, at last, I would like to say, it is a time to save our nation. It is a time to save our nation from the evils, from the slavery actions, which is pulling back to our nation. We should be aware to solve our social evils. So again, I would like to thank you to all of you who are here with us to enjoy the program. Thanks.